guys hello it's John here from Dan and John Motorsports I see that I was on the channel today and I saw you guys really liked that video of the walk around of Dan's old snowmobile and so I figured I'd just show you guys uh, a little bit of the ninja so uh, yeah let's get on with the video so let's start down here 250 cubic centimeters and Kawasaki engine obviously stock you know everything is stock on this uh, twin cam 8 valve stock dual exhaust you know it sounds like a moped I um, actually took the baffles out of them sounds a little bit louder than it was before um, got this tank bed for it of course, it's Kawasaki Green. A little over 6,000 miles on it. Uh, had to get um, new carbs. Well, not new. It was from a bike salvage out in, I don't even know, somewhere not close. But, because the other ones were messed up and I feel like working on them. So, uh, got the flush mount turn signals. Other than that, it's pretty, pretty stock, bone stock, pretty much. So, uh, it's a 2000, by the way. Um, I guess I'll turn the key here. You can see my LED turn signals. That's how it looks on the other side, too. So, um,. Yeah, I guess I'll fire it up quick. Let you guys hear it. And it's also um, also cooled out, but um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I guess I'll show you guys the little things that are wrong with it. Not wrong with it, just cosmetic. Previous owner dropped it, of course, because it's a beginner bike, so bound to happen. There's a little dent here. It looks kind of worse on the camera than it really is. Um, these, um, what, what do you want to call them? Uh, handle bar ends. They're a little dented up, but who cares, you know. And here's about the worst of it. Right there. We got this little crack here. Doesn't bother me, though. Got a good deal on it. But other than that, I mean, it's... And, it's in really good condition for how old it is and how many all of these that I went through whenever I was looking for one almost all of them you know were dropped and beat up because beginner bike you know it's what people learn on so people beat them up I haven't dropped it or any of that but then again I, as you guys know I've been riding for a while but yeah that's pretty much all I wanted to show you there will be some more videos coming out on this I don't plan on keeping it for too awful long probably like a year or so not more than a year before I'm ready to move up I don't know if I'm going to go for sport bike or want to go cruiser or dual sport I don't know but um so yeah that's that's the new thing thank you guys for watching this I can't thank you enough for watching this um I guess I'll see you guys in the next video, where whether it's me or Dan. I uh, hope I know that it's been a long time since we've made a video together, and I don't know when that's gonna happen again. Cause Dan's still in the off road, and obviously I'm moved on to road bikes, and Dan doesn't plan on getting one for a while. So I don't know. Dan has. 
two four wheelers, and I was still over there riding over the weekend here. So I don't know. Maybe next time I go over there, I don't know how soon that'll be, but next time I go over there, I'll see about taking over both GoPros, since we both have GoPros now. And um, we'll take a short vid for you guys, just because it's a lot funner when we're together and we do dumb shit, you know. But um, yeah, see you guys in the next video. Sorry for rambling on. Have a good one.